Hi, I'm over at Jerry's. They're gonna, they're gonna scalp me today. Uh, I gotta start working out to catch up, but I was gonna go bald, man. <laughs> not quite, not quite. Hell, I'll be bald before I know it. Trust this man right here with my life. Just for the next four weeks. <laughs> yeah. I always tell people, like, some people will get bad at their haircut or something. I go, my hair grows pretty quick, so. Especially on the sides, uh, it's, you know. <laughs> I do like a hard part on the. Okay. Um, that's kind of why I trim it to be honest with you man it's because I I get that gray on the side like the the guy from the Sopranos, I got the wings. Yeah. <laughs> so the gray started kicking in the last year. the new style we'll we'll cut it in the middle leave it on the side <laughs> I have yeah I don't even trust myself to shave the side so like every three four weeks I'm in here my buddy Saria, he cuts his hair by himself. Like it's the craziest thing. He looks in the mirror and he can do it. Yeah, it's hard to reach around with your arms, you know. I, know. He, I mean, it's free. No, he, he does a great. It's crazy. He, I mean, he's always done it. He's just, he's like, nah, I just save. I just cut it myself, and it always looks like you know. Some some people, you know, but he can draw. He can do all those those kinds of things. So. Me, I'd probably poke myself in the eye, the ear, you know, I'd be bleeding. start looking in the camera for a while and it's like you got one of those aging programs you know you start to go down and get mold yeah I, I, I believe it, man. Believe it. it's coming everybody right it's like yeah, yeah. I just, I just turned 55. oh really yeah. oh you're a young looking dude bro uh, yeah i tell my mom it's a blessing and a curse <laughs> the old ladies think i'm young and the young girls think i'm old so i'm old <laughs> <laughs> in a hard place I think I was like 6'2 in 7th grade, I went to the 7th grade dance, Yeah. and the girl that like I danced with, I mean, I think she came up to my knee, it was very awkward to dance, <laughs> I'll never forget, he'll go, oh, you're blessed because you're tall, I go, buddy, when it comes to dancing, there's not a blessing there, you know, and my wife's 5'1". <laughs> Kids, they're tall. Oh, really? tall, yeah. My son, he's, he's 11th grade. He's, he's 6'2. He's still growing. Yeah. My godson's 6'5, six, six, going on 6'6. Six, six. He's in 10th mm -hmm. grade. Crazy. But his dad's 6'3. 
And his mom's six one, six two. So. At my age, it starts shrinking. Yeah, that's what's yeah. Going. Back issues years ago. I think I lost an inch. At least. Every time I have a back issue, I feel like I'm, yeah. Don't trip, Ben. What's that? So don't trip. Oh, yeah. Slip and fall. <laughs> like slip and fall. And... <laughs> you can't do the lie. Send a picture, tell my wife I'm starting a new uh, yeah, a yeah, new trend a right there. Yeah. You go viral. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For all the wrong reasons. You know, my dad was gray from like 17. Yeah, I had an uncle that was like that. Yeah. Yeah. When I was a kid, it was like light brown. And then for like three years, my hair just, I don't know, being that in the sun or whatever, it was like a blonde. It looked like, you know. Yeah. But no one in my family, everyone's dark hair. And, uh, it's like the joke, or where did the blonde hair come from? And then kind of stayed brown, and then now now it's it looks like it's frosted, but it's like gray. It's like you know, but it's 
just a size. The top's pretty decent, pretty good, man. Isn't it weird rather than soft? I told my wife it's her. She was giving you the gray? Yeah, it's so yeah. honey. I guess almost kind of, yeah, like, like, you know, both sides will be short, not really even comb over, almost like spiky up. It's kind of, I don't want to quite go crew cut, but you know what I mean? Like, I just want it very short on the top. I wish I had the cojones to just go, man, just do it. I, as it gets warm, you know, I, I kind of, you know, summer, I mean, we're in April, but another month or two, it gets pretty hot over here. Hey, forget about, forget about it. <laughs> How's your boy? I forget his name. He's all right, man. Doing good? Yeah, he is. He actually is, man. He is. He seemed like a nice guy. Yeah. What's his name? What's his first name? Billy. Billy, yeah. Billy. Billy's all right, man. He's a lot better now. He's a lot better to do. Oh, and then you got my buddy Charlie. Oh, really? And I sent you away, too. Yeah, Charlie, the, the older guy was on a radio show. He got his hands like that. His son Mike got jammed up in you know, a suspended license. Long Island people. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, he didn't even tell me. Yeah, yeah. See, he said he called you the other day, and you said, like, oh, hey, Charlie, how are you? Like, because you knew him or something from. Oh, really? Way back when from Long Island or from back. Wait a second. Wait, what's his, what's his last name? Oh, I'll oh, oh, save that video. I think I know who it is. Yeah. Oh, well, his, now, his son got in Charlie, trouble? Yeah, his son's Mike. I just got off the phone with him his a little earlier. His son's like, is, you know, yeah. big boy. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I know. But yeah, it's funny I because I, I thought it was the son calling me because I know him. Oh, I used okay. to go to jujitsu with him. Yes, that's what and, it was. And then that's all of a sudden, I saw that, but I didn't realize it was the dad. I literally just got off the phone. He just called me like five minutes right before now, I walked yeah, in yeah, here. Yeah, I gave him your He's coming in my, I appreciate it, bro. Thanks for looking out. Don't forget, they're all stems from me. <laughs> I, don't, you know, I was just looking, I was like, man, I gotta get some cards over here. I don't have any cards over here. I was like, I used to have like a stack out front. <laughs> yeah, you're sure, brother. I, like, no. I'm taking my time. Here, yeah, so yeah, I'll take it, yeah, yeah. Like, hey, little, It's easier to go shorter. <laughs> nah, sure, 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 I gotcha. Jerry would have had fun with it. He just would have zipped right through it. He would have been like, good? And I was like, yeah, we're good. <laughs> good Yeah, that hair's thinning, boy. You should get older. It's like horse hair. I just had my teeth cleaned at my, my wife's office and uh, I didn't tell her I was getting a haircut. That's why I was like, I just do it. But she's always like, you need a haircut. You need a haircut. Oh, Two no. weeks after I get a haircut, she goes, you need a haircut. So that's why I was like, you know what? Just do it short today. And I'll, she'll come home tonight and she'll go, what the? I go, you, yeah. You're always getting on me. I just, I'm ahead of the game. Yeah. You married? No. I'm divorced. Ah, sorry. 
Yeah. I got three trophies out of the deal. I got custody. There you go. And I was watching something on Netflix last night, and I said to my wife, I said, you know, like, I was watching um, Lincoln Lawyer. I don't know if you watched the episode. No. And, uh, you know, the guy, it's like he works with his second wife, the first wife, he's, you know, like that kind of thing. But uh, I said, man, that must be difficult. Like, when, when, you know, I've never been divorced, so I just, I'm going, like, if you have kids, like, you know, they have kids in common and stuff, like, on the show. Yeah. And, you know, we, all, we almost, it's become a part of society, but I just said, like, that there's got to be some really dark, like, where you're just like, man, this, and you want to go talk to the person that was your best friend or the love of your life, and then, and then you have that awkward time, and then, you know, they start dating or whatever, you know. Yeah. And I go, I don't know, that, that would just bother me, you know. So, uh, you know. It depends. I, I, I know. Mine, I, mine, I think she's living with somebody now, and I'm like, that is his problem now. That ain't my problem. <laughs> 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 kind of like when the kids grow up and get married, got a thing, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Time to move out. It's yeah, it's funny. Funny. I've been raising three kids on my own for ten years. Wow. Um, what what age? Just started well, paying child support. Oh really? Oh, they were locked up. It was me that locked me up long Yeah, that's true to that. That's another area, like family law is just tough, right? No one's happy. No. That, that's why I don't do that. I, I had know. a good lawyer. I was real happy with him. Yeah, he's out of my gardens. Okay. Thank you so much. I'm not always the best at holding hands, like, so to speak, you know, and and I feel like you just, you know, people rant when they're emotional, you know, Yeah. with what I do, criminal defense and personal injury, like personal injury, it's just being empathetic and, you know, and trying to get them the, yeah, the financial yeah. stuff, but mm -hmm. with the criminal, it's their freedom, and it's like, hey, man, you don't know me, I got you, I'm, I'm going to do everything I can do, and, uh, and then, you know, you, uh, you always aim to overachieve, so to speak. It's that there's a lot of guys that talk and uh, they they boast and oh I know this person. It doesn't matter who you know. I get matters like your facts and how hard you work and you know. Yeah. Sometimes there's a little luck of the draw, you know. But family is another. I want the dog. I want the kid. Uh, they delivered them late. You know all these. Yeah. And it's just. I didn't get the money, and it's like, oh, goodness. But, but they make a killing, right? I mean, family lawyers are it's kind of like dentists, the people that you don't realize that make the the big bucks. Yeah, yeah. Right, family lawyers and dentists, like. I don't know what I spent in that guy. Good, probably good seven grand. Yeah, that, that, was, that was over 10 years ago. I've heard of people spending like 200 grand. Yeah, I know, yeah. You know, a guy that owned a company. I mean, she tried to take him dry here, but I yeah, ain't happening. <laughs> he paid out that kind of money. Yeah. And still ended up paying out like eight grand a month. Eight yeah. Eight grand a month for child support, man. Are you kidding me? It's all by statute. There's yeah, not even much that. the attorney can do. It only fluctuates 5%. And if like someone's not working, they impute and they might impute like minimum wage or something. Going so you can go. Yeah. I'm broke. I don't, I don't. I don't work. I don't make anything. Now they, they take. They look at everything. <laughs> they pull your yeah, tax yeah, returns, yeah. all your all your banking records. Yeah. Like what toys you have. If you got an ATV, I mean, there you know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's it's not fun. Yeah, you you can go shorter, but I'm gonna like, I'm gonna my shit will grow. <laughs> Keep going? Yeah, man. I'm just going to go short because I'm going to put a little gel in it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Where are you at? I'm going to say six, something like that.
I'm, here's what I'm thinking. I'm kind of thinking like how I normally have up on this side. Yeah. I'm, I mean, take it all the way up like that. Well, I'll let you blend because you know that you're a business. I don't. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go like uh, just like like a little bit up, and then I'll put a little. It's gonna grow. I'm a, I'm a I'll be here. In, I'll be here in four it. weeks. You'll you'll say. <laughs> the sides grow. Like I leave here like within four or five days. Uh, my hair is there. I'm going son of a gun because it looks awkward, right? When you you know you kind of leave the. Yeah. The muffin hat on top, and then you uh, you got the shaved sides. It, it kind of looks look like a chia pet a little bit, you know. Yeah. It's a, like a week or two into it. I don't know if you you remember like high school and stuff. How everybody was like finagling with their hair. You go out to your boys, and it's like a bunch of chicks, like because it's almost like you know they go meet go meet the females at the club or you know wherever. And like everyone, you know, I lived on Long Island, so everyone's like doing their hair and shit. And I had a buddy that had like long hair. We're like, come on, what are you doing? You know, we all, I had short hair like my whole life. But I remember waiting for my buddy Mike and I'm going, come on, dude, are you kidding me? You know, like. Yeah, you gotta do the hairspray and everything, you know? <laughs> I'm not kidding you, bro. The, the early 90s, the late 80s, you know. It's like a different world, man. Oh, it was, man. No doubt. No video games, unless you went to the arcade. They had a uh, ColecoVision when I was a kid. Yeah, there was a... In television, Atari. Yeah, 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 all that stuff. I didn't have the money for that. Me neither, man. We didn't have it. I literally, about two years ago... I saw online one of those arcade up games, yeah. and uh, it was Asteroids. Okay. I, I started yeah. because I didn't have money. Because you, know, you had to put a quarter. We didn't have a quarter. Like there was no, no money to do that. No, no, I so, so I literally went and I bought. I ended up meeting uh, the guy that owns uh, the women's NBA. He, uh, I don't even know where he lives. It was Palm Beach or Fort Lauderdale. But he put it up, it was like 80 bucks, like super cheap for an arcade. And uh, I said, what's going on? He's like, I, I said, why are you selling it? He goes, someone gave it to me as a gift. He goes, I, I don't really play it. He goes, so I just, it was brand new, 80 bucks. So I, I got that thing sitting in, uh, not to my wife's, uh, to her chagrin a little bit. I have it sitting in like our, like our eating area. I got a freaking arcade game in the middle of the room. Do you still have to put a No, no, it's... Just set on auto save one of two places when someone comes by. Yeah, that's cool. And then I bought one of those old table machines. I don't know if you've ever seen them. They got like 50, 60 games. It's like Pac Man, Donkey Kong, Centerpiece, uh, Galaga, all that stuff that, you know, even some of that's kind of before, yeah. Um, even some of the stuff that was like before my time, but it was, you know, you knew about it and, you know. And uh, I, it's, you know, some yeah. people will come by and you know, I'll say, hey, and they go, no way, you got all these games and just, you know, kind of play them. Arcade games are too damn, you know, people, I have a PS5, but, and I suck at all of them, man. Yeah. It's, uh. I got the Xbox. I still yeah. play, oh, I got into video games in the, in the 90s, like, what was it, PlayStation? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, Xbox when yeah. everything came out, yeah. And I've been playing ever since. Oh, really? It's amazing. It's unbelievable. What do you? What do you? What's your game? Uh, I got my two two games is my, um, hockey. I get hockey every year. Okay. I've been playing that since the nineties. My, my cousin used to come over and have like little tournaments and stuff. And back then, the teams were so good, you couldn't be certain teams. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, no, uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, there was no, uh, no beating. And then I play Skyrim. That's a wild game. It's like a Dungeons and Dragons type game. Was well, it called Skyrim? Yeah. I've never heard of it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's been out for 12 years, but they've done so much with it. It's unbelievable, you know? Yeah. It's unbelievable. Yeah. We have a friend of the family who design uh, video games, you know, like crazy games. So he came to visit, you know, with his, his wife and whatever in their, our house. And I, you know, I don't know what he did. You know, he's an older guy. Yeah. Should I just drop this? Um, sorry, brother. And thank you. Yeah. 
And so I said, hey, well, what kind of games do you desi design? And he's like, I said, anything like on PlayStation that I would know? And so he, uh, he turned me on to a game called uh, Diablo, Diablo 4. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I just signed up. It was like 49, 59 bucks. And I played that thing. I mean, you know, it's weird because, you know, like I'm not good. But he he went on and like, you know, he could zip through a game because he's like, you know, one of the guys that helped design these kinds of games. So he's like, I right, try this. And that, like, you know, ended up sitting there. It's like, you know, the wives went to do something. And, you know, me and this, this older guy ended up playing for probably like eight hours straight, 10 hours straight. It was crazy. But, uh, yeah, man, you, you get lost in time. Yeah, for, for, sure. for sure, yeah. I, I enjoy, play, like, if I'm going to play, it doesn't matter. It could be, a, you know, a board game. I, I just enjoy, like, a group of people, like, the laughing, the camaraderie, like, oh, yeah, you, you back in sports, you know what I mean? I played I played Madden, like, six months ago. Yeah. Oh, Christmas, last year. More than six months ago. And all of a sudden, I'm online with, like, I don't know, it's like 12 yeah. or 13-year-old kid, you yeah. know? And then he goes, he goes, mister, he goes, mister. And I'm like, you know, he's like, so I'm like, I'm going to spank you. Like, blah, blah, blah. Oh, <laughs> and, then he, and then he goes, oh, you seem like a nice guy. He goes, I'm not going to talk too much smack. And I think he beat me like 60, 63 yeah, yeah, to like right. three or something. Right, you know, it was right, just right. funny. But he, as, as, you know, as the ticket, the, you know, the, the, the fourth quarter was ticking down, he goes, I'm not even going to talk smack, you know. But it's just funny, like, yeah, 12, 13, yeah. Yeah, it's hilarious, man. My kids have been on that for a long time, the games. And I always tell people I'm good at Madden. <laughs> I just, oh, I got, I got spanked. When Madden came out, I, I would have my cousin would play me. Uh-huh. He, he was every single, it was not even any fun anymore, so I just never, I just quit Madden. Oh really? Yeah, I just was like, nah, anytime, suck. anytime I played with someone that wasn't very good, I would, um, I would simply kind of like, you know, try plays that I never tried before that I would get sacked, or you know, like, because I'm going, oh, let me figure out how these, you know, yeah, because I'm like a run, throw some short passes, throw a deep ball, like every, you know, 17 plays or so, trying to mix right, it up. Right. But uh, when I play online, I get, I get spanked. It's, it's, it's not good. Kids play it all day long, I know, I know, I know. But I played college ball. I played semi-pro ball. You would, I think I would know something, but I don't None know. I, it doesn't matter. I don't know shit, you know. Buttons, yeah. Well, I, I got these mitts, Jerry. I got these, you know. You need a special controller. <laughs> yeah, I know. I always go, it's the controller. It's the controller. No, not yet. No, I just, I, I, I can tell when it's like with a little bit of gel or something in it. Yeah. How about right in here? You want to get rid of this? Yeah, you, whatever you think to. Okay, no. Yeah, I'm at your mercy, brother. Whatever you, uh, however you make it. Yeah. But you guys always do a great job, and uh, Jerry's, I, I can't complain. Yeah, about that. Yeah, Jerry told me, just buy one of these things. I'm like, brother, I'll, not, I'll screw that up. I'm not doing that. <laughs> you can't see. I'm not, you know. Yeah. I'm like, I'll, I'll see you in three weeks, four weeks. I'll be there. It's like the same sound that when uh, Cartman and South Park 
when the aliens came down and gave the anal probe or whatever. It's like the same sound from the... I don't know how they get away with those shows. That's so no, funny, dude. They're hilarious. When I was in college, we would watch South Park. It was just funny. A friend of mine, um, this girl, Jennifer, gave me like a... It's weird because I don't collect any of that stuff, but she's like, you're always watching South Park. And I just find it witty, you know, some of the chef yep. and, and all that. So she bought me some of those characters. I don't know what happened to him. I never took him out of the box. It was one of those things that, you know. It might be worth money in hundred years. Yeah, but. <laughs> I tell people I'm like a great Dane. I don't, I don't know that I'll get to. You know, when you're walking around 250, 260, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I'm doing a, if, I'm, if I got a, you know, a century in me. Yeah, right, right. The, uh, the palm reader told me I would live to 89. I don't know. What do they call those people? Besides crazy. Huh? A Zinga? A Zinga? Yeah, a Zingula. Yeah, she... Yeah, she she told me I was gonna live till eighty nine, Jerry. You do? Oh man. They, it's like you get a second opinion? No, I've had four. Oh shit. Uh, I've got three MRIs coming this Tuesday, and then I'm going doctor What, the chip reader fall out? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm, I'm kidding with you. You know, with the gas pumps, they put the chip they got and they wipe out the fur. I'm just kidding with you. <laughs> you making the car payment, Jerry? <laughs> He said he was shopping for a doctor, right? We start yeah, before right? he started with that yeah, credit card. A little bit, put it away. <laughs> All right, shorter. Now nah, just uh, try some. Uh, Gel. Yeah, that, that, I think that's the key, my man. No one in my family's been bald, but I, I might be the first guy. I don't know. So what's up with the doctor? So I'm saying, I mean, uh, you know, I broke my seventh vertebrae and all that shit. You know what I mean? Now it's from my seven and my two is fusing. And, uh, Jeez, bro. It's, it's below that, even. What's fucked up. But I don't know. It's, you know, years and years of abuse. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I just kind of do. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm caught up. Yeah, kind of like that. That's... Oh, yeah. Maybe a... 
and check these bad boys. So I. Uh... You can break those things, man. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> So what are they going to do? How do you unfuse if it's fusing? Do they? No, they're not, I'm not going to let them touch my neck. I'm not going to let them do anything with my neck. I'm just going to... What is it? My spinal cord is in between uh -huh. my vertebrae, and they got to wallow them out. I'm always... You know, I'm just... Well, believe me. I'm, you're weary, right? You're like me. We grew up the same... Like, I, uh, I have nothing to do with that. You know what I mean? But this is what's happened to me. Yeah, un oh. unsteady. And I can't walk. My balance is for shit. You know, it's crazy. Can you press it there and I, and I concentrate and I move around and I hit the bag? I'm okay. But then I'm still like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, when you're going, when you're doing regular stuff. Oh, it's unbelievable. I have no balance. I have to make a conscious effort. You know what I'm saying? You see what I'm looking like in there? I guess you're doing nothing. All right, mess with that a little bit. You want a lime in there, right? Yeah, a lime and yep. yeah. Can you make it a little square, almost like a flat top ish? Or is yeah, that possible, or does yeah, that too yeah, much? Yeah, no. Told you I was going short, Jerry. <laughs> yeah. Your boy's taking care of me, man. So you it's. Don't even drink coffee, do, you, Mike? do I? Yeah. You Yeah, not, not in the afternoon, though. No. You're a jittery fucker. I know. Man. Tell me about it. Wait, what did you say? You didn't have the coffee? No, I said you don't drink coffee. Oh. I, I drink one cup in the morning, and that's it. Never yeah, been? I got, I got nerve issues. Some days are better than others. I have bad days that I have worse days. The bad ones are bad. Do you make coffee every morning? No. You guys don't. I use a monster. Oh, okay. Monster coffee. So no, that's it all day. No, no nothing. No caffeine. So no what's service, it? No nothing. What's the timeline, Jerry? For what? For the doctor, you get well, like. I don't know. I'm on Tuesday, I go for my MRIs, and then once that happens. I want to, one of the guys I cut with the doctor. Mm -hmm. So they gave me three guys. Barcelos gave me a guy. I'm going to do my homework, you know what I mean? What guy? The head guy? The guy that just worked? Yeah, or, uh, or to get the, the to actual get, uh, surgeon. Oh, the surgeon. Oh, surgeon. Oh, I get it, yeah, yeah. I need a neurosurgery and a spinal cord surgery. Yeah. That's a big, man. Okay. God willing, you'll be okay, buddy. I just want to be able to walk with you guys. If not, we'll get you a walker. We'll get the nice tennis balls. They say Spalding. We'll keep it sharp, brother. Get you some Adidas uh, shell tops. You know? And then we'll get you, because you, you can't put the jeans on, we'll get you the... You know, the stripper pants that pop off with the Velcro for you? <laughs> Ones with the snap-up sides. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> yeah. Well, well, dude, as you get home. older and your back goes out and stuff like that, you want you don't want shoelaces, you don't no, want any of that stuff. I've had yeah. the shots already. Have you? Yeah, four designs, two of them. It, it worked. I, I couldn't walk for eight Nine weeks. Nine weeks it took them. Every once in a while my back goes out. It's miserable, dude. Mm -hmm. There's... Sweet. That's fine. That almost looks like I'm uh, joining the service. There you go.
Yeah. yeah, yeah, I didn't. Your head flat top. Yeah, he got, well, he got the head for it too. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that's what my dad called me when he was pissed off. A jarhead. <laughs> you know. Sorry. I did a flat top today on a guy. He didn't have the head or the hair for it. It's like, man, I hate that. I got a big. He had a big mug. Sweet. How about the old times when you you watch those old westerns and the the barbers doing the shave to like the you know and he's just <laughs> with the strap and he's saying. Uh, if you cut me, I'm going to shoot you right now. And the guy's <laughs> like, shame. he's totally shaking and shit, you know. <laughs> Talk about pressure, right? I had a guy once that... Uh, I've, I've seen some pictures of them old barbershops, though. Them, those dudes had shotguns laying in the corner. <laughs> you, you won't go through none. I had a guy that I was representing him on a trafficking case. And uh, so walking down the hallway, he says... Uh, you know, at the time, my, my fiance and, and my dad's name. And he said, I just want to let you know if uh, my people said, if you don't win this, um, they're going to pay a visit. And dude, you can't imagine how mad someone could get. Like, I, I literally thought about beating him to, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, uh, you know, I had to file a motion to withdraw and all that. And the judge took me like four times to get off the case. I go, judge, like the guy threatened my family. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, right. And the crazy thing is, is like, you don't need to, I'm already a guy that's motivated. So, but I don't know, I just think of those crazy stories or the pressure, you know what I mean? Like if, uh, you don't need it, you don't need you, to hear it. You, you will win, you yeah, know what I mean? Like, that's not gonna make me win, you know? Yeah. If you take pride in whatever you do, like, you know. Right. So that's what I was saying, like the, the guy that's holding his, a six shooter and saying, if you cut me, yeah. <laughs> you know, you, you know, we're gonna bury you in a pine box kind of shit. There's so much crazy stuff going on out there now, it's unbelievable. Dude, the, the value of life is just, you know, people don't value life. No, and it's, it's upside down and backwards. It really is. There's so many killings and shootings and. I just edged them up. The way you are. Alright. Now, let me get some neck. I didn't know Sweet, brother. Alright. 110 flat. <laughs> hey! Special price for today. <laughs> the video's got its own prices. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like 112.99. <laughs> <laughs> My God, you can't buy a dozen eggs for less than like 10 bucks, so, you know. This is uh, Jerry's over here in Jupiter. He's got two locations. If you check it out, it's like an old, old school barber place. It's got all the memorabilia. Jerry over there in the corner. My man, I've been coming here for, I don't know, 10 years. 
all these guys a great Vinny over there yep. holding down holding down the fort but uh you know i post i always post stuff brother so you know i got love for jerry's barber shop so my man just look made me look halfway reasonable i got a motion coming up so try to scare him <laughs> put on a, a russian outfit and walk into the into the courtroom you know all right we're looking good appreciate it